All right, here we go. Come on. It was a bittersweet morning for gaming officials and customers Monday as the building that served as Hard Rock's temporary casino officially closed its doors. <laughs> Rockford resident Tom Tendall was the last guest to walk out of the temporary casino on North Bell School Road Monday, marking the last number for Hard Rock's opening act in the Forest City. I feel kind of privileged to be part of it. It's been a really good experience. As the last of more than 1.5 million guests at the temporary casino, since it opened in November 2021, Tendall was given the honor of locking the door for the last time. He also won a few dollars Sunday night, making his final visit well worth his time. Uh, we did good. Um, got a little bit of the money today, and that, that was uh, positive for me. The staff and the management here is just professional, very nice. Officials now have their sights on Thursday, August 29th, the day the new Hard Rock Casino will go live. So everybody's a little bit sad. Custom, you know, guests and team members all night have said, man, it's, you know, it's sad. But at the same time, everybody's excited to get the get the new one up and running. It's been almost five years since Alderman voted 11 to 1 to roll the dice on a casino in Rockford. Hard Rock Casino President Gino Iafrate remembers the scramble to get the temporary facility up and running. That was a you know a, a whirlwind because you know when we took over this building, it was like 107 days from start to finish to get this thing open. After a series of pandemic-related delays, crews finally broke ground on the new casino in September 2022. And then just under two years to to build the big joint, and that feels like it's fast, right? Reporting from Rockford for your home team, I'm Jim Haggerty.